couple of our engines that we have out here, our CF6 engine. This uh, engine was donated years ago by American Airlines. It's off of an old DC-10. It's a great opportunity to see what a high bypass turbofan engine looks like. And again, our students will work with it, work on it, um, get a good opportunity to see how things function in the real world. We love to say that we're hands-on and we actually want our students to be touching and feeling, taking things apart. Cool. We've got our Sabre liner. We use this for systems training. We use it for turbine engines. We remove the engines off of here, put it back on throughout the semester. Um, our 310 cutaway. Over here, you can see our engine run-up stands. These run-up stands are where the students will take the engines once they've put them together. And they can run them, they can operate them up to full power. Then they get the opportunity to see how everything works in there. Additionally, uh, we're working on completing our turbine engine run-up cell right here. This is our gray building. Uh, hopefully very soon we'll have a PT6 engine that can go in there and we can operate it through the parameters of its use as well. Uh, another engine, our CFM56 under the cover over here, that was donated by Southwest a couple years ago. That is the engine off of a 737. So again, a great opportunity to see real world um, engines, real world aircraft, and operational work on them, whatever we need to do. Uh, our Cessna 421, our 182, and our King Air all over here. These are all lab airplanes. These are airplanes that we use in the lab itself so that we can teach students exactly what they need to know as they're working through, as they're learning about systems, as they're learning about landing gear or engines operation or any of the other things that are required of an A&P mechanic. Uh, 